Hello there. If you're encountering the headset microphone issues with Windows 11, here's the TLDR or TLDW version of it. So try and check your microphone setting in Windows. Go to the system sound properties and hopefully you can adjust the input volume here and then test your mic and see if that works for you. If that doesn't work, similar to what happened to me, you probably have to install the drivers or any application provided by your sound card maker or the uh, motherboard if it's a built-in audio chip in your motherboard. So in my case, I was in a virtual meeting yesterday with my headset on. I could hear all the people talking. It was clear and everything seemed to be fine. But when I started to talk, they said my voice was very low. So I tried unplugging and plugging the port back on and then it still didn't work. I even tried a couple of more headsets that I had, but still didn't work. So it was more of a driver issue. So I actually had to drop off the call and call back using my cell phone. And after that, I tried the headsets with my phone and I knew they worked because um, I was using my old headset anyways on my phone for a while now. And uh, I tried all three with my phone and they all work. And then that's when I started to try and figure out what the problem was. So the problem was, even if I maxed out the sound setting here, if I'm plugged into the <clears throat> front port, it it's just low, basically. It can't hear me, basically. Um, if on the rear port, it's plugged in using the split connector, it would actually work. So I didn't wanna, you know, I didn't wanna hook it up that way basically because I have it hooked up to my the rear panel is uh, I mean the rear port is hooked up to my speaker and so I looked around and then I would have thought the Microsoft default audio driver would have been good enough to run these standard devices I mean it's it's just a headset basically right I mean it's been there for for years and I would have thought the generic driver would be enough to manage it so I went back to the manual my motherboard manual basically and then from there i started searching for the real tech uh piece so yep they do have the uh, it shows the real tech alc 4080 audio chip here and then they have this audio console so then if that's the case then i thought of just downloading the application and installing it so I did go to the MS, MSI website for the motherboard specific to mine, went to the driver, got the Realtek HD universal driver, and then installed it. After installing it, everything's going well. I've tested it. I mean, I'm using the headset right now on the front port, so it's great. So if th this is similar to the problem you're having, go to your motherboard or sound card maker, get their specific driver or application, and then adjust it from there. And after that, you should be gravy. That's it. I hope this helps, and have a good day. Bye.